inflammatory breast cancer, the patient presents with redness and swollen breast. Uh, they may not have a mass, and that's the uniqueness of this disease. Inflammatory breast cancer usually involves the entire breast and the skin. Its involvement in the skin often will mask our ability to see the breast lesion. But with imaging, we have the luxury of being able to see those lesions without invasive procedure. With imaging, we can actually determine if the patient responds or not and how much. Mammogram has limited role in inflammatory breast cancer because of the inflammatory component. We need more advanced technology, such as ultrasound to look at lymph nodes, MRI to identify where the key or the index breast lesion is so that we can target that lesion to do biopsy. A tissue diagnosis that establishes um, a basic diagnosis of invasive breast cancer is important to start the management of the patients. Once a patient with inflammatory breast cancer uh, has neoadjuvant chemotherapy, and if the patient is found to be a candidate for mastectomy, the tissue that is obtained on the pathology end is evaluated uh, to great lengths to, eva uh, to establish the residual cancer burden. The uniqueness of our IBC clinic is that uh, we would uh, take any type of patient who have history of IBC from newly diagnosed. And we also accept a second opinion. Uh, because it's a rare disease, we are very open to have providing accessibility to uh, many patients as much as possible at MDMC.